the military came over the hill. Even before I got to the ground, I was shot in the leg. A sharp pain and a pop. Martin was bleeding from his chest, and he was breathing just kind of heavy, almost like snoring. There was just gunfire from everywhere. And I, in that moment, tried to do what Martin had always taught me, keep your head in a gun battle, lay there still until someone tells you what to do. I was trying to look dead. All of a sudden, he got heavy. You know that term, the weight of death? I think maybe that's what it was, but I didn't know. Then I heard the soldiers I looked back at Martin, and Martin was white. And that's when I knew that he was dead. And I remember having this thought, but what about Martin? He was still on the hillside. And as we were pulling away in the helicopter, I thought, I just left my best friend dead in the rain. That is not the way I would have ended our story.